Uh, I think we need more reliefs on things, really. Um, certainly on the business rate side of things, you know, the VAT on tickets is another absolute stick because, you know, we're paying VAT on loads of tickets, but we barely ever claim any of it back on the live front anyway. Um, just need more help from the government in subsidies. I know what it's like in Europe. I know what it's like in Australia and various other countries. You know, that money that they give back to touring artists and for live music venues. We just need a lot more help from the, you know, from the UK government on that side of things to make sure that we can, you know, Every band who tours, whenever they come to the UK, they're just like, oh, we're playing in the UK again, especially if they're from Europe or America. When they go out to Europe, they get treated like kings, you know, they full on riders, everything's given to them on a plateau. When you come over here, we have to cut so many corners, you know, we're not able to give them absolutely everything that they want because we're just not supported enough. It's great to have a big champion. Um, I met Steve last year because we uh, did a special show at the Sunflower Lounge in Birmingham for the Witches, which he came down to, so it was really nice to talk to him there. But it's really nice to have all these champions, especially like Steve, uh, especially like I think Frank did it last year or, or, or the year before, to have musicians who have used that whole grassroots system through to start championing. What we do need is more of those bands that need to remember where they came from and where they started to go back into those venues more regularly so that we, you know, we can, you know, that's where they came from and to start making us some money because we put a lot of investment in them in the first place. Uh, but yeah, champions like Steve are great, perfect, we just need more of them.